I've been working corporate for over 30 years and I found it was no longer pushing my buttons, quite frankly. And I saw the opportunity to, uh, to get out of the, uh, the environment I was in and to create a life for myself, a lifestyle um, that would provide for me but also allow me to give back to the uh, business owners um, the knowledge that I gained within the corporate world. Business can be pretty lonely um, and I see business coaching uh, or business coach is providing the opportunity to, um, to provide support to the business owner and to just generally get in and, and encourage them, take them through uh, the glass ceilings maybe that they're putting on themselves um, and, and to show them that there's more to life than working 50 plus hours a week. What I love most about coaching business owners, I think sharing the results that they get. Um, having a, getting a phone call from a client saying that they've finally achieved their first million dollars in turnover and hearing the excitement and, uh, and so on in their, in their voice or receiving an email um, that they've sent to me late at night and I've received, I've opened it up in the morning saying that hey they completed the calls that they said they were going to do that day and uh, you've got the results that they were looking for and reading the excitement and the, the pride and the words that they've written on the paper. I think to me that's what really makes coaching. I guess because they challenge me, and I don't like being challenged, <laughs> uh, they hold me accountable. It's may have made me see that I, uh, my limitations were around my own glass ceiling that I had, and they've taken me beyond that and uh, and helped me to explore new avenues within my personal life and within my business. First one is collusion and second one is ego. So for me it's about showing empathy, not sympathy. It's understanding and asking the questions and making sure that I understand exactly what's behind what's going on or what's being discussed before I offer suggestions or move forward. First thing would be helping them define their vision. If they haven't got a vision or a passion or a dream, then I want to know why they're there. The second thing I think is um, helping them create their dashboard, establish their KPIs so they get to understand the business and actually see how exciting it can be when they've got all that information. I think because I'm more passionate about their businesses than they are. When I go in and I see them, I can see the excitement or the opportunities um, that are there to help to grow the business. And so I bring energy with it, me into their business and uh, help them to, to see it as well and build their energy because I think often they're wanting it because it's energy and so on that they're lacking. Because I like to work with people who don't want to spend all their time justifying what they know. They want to be open to new ideas, innovations, doing things differently, thinking outside the box and, uh, and just want to move forward and have fun because that's me. Mm -hmm.